I don't get intimidated easily if I'm doing something that I think I should be doing, right? Um, sometimes when I work with institutions, they can, as I said, there's a lot of politics involved. And because I'm not your typical mainstream thinker, sometimes I have to go at it. You know, like even the last show I just did was with ArtServe, and they're a white institution. It's the first time they've had a black curator. And some of those people are more mainstream than I am in terms of they, they took a certain path to, to be who they are, right? So I, I survived it, and I think I changed the institution in the process, you know? So I, in, in fairness to you, I, I can't remember specifically what would be the first show that I thought was because, you know, and in some, and, and I'm talking about in a formal sense too, because when you think about it, my, my thing is that because of the way I came into the space, a lot of times I would be, I, I had access to free travel, right? So I would be doing something at the Sorbonne in Paris that would be an informal way of doing art. But I was always very good at getting an audience, right? Um, even before we had the social media thing going on, right? Um, because I'm a connector, you know, I've been doing just, you know, Paris is a city that I have lots of friends from Africa and Paris, you know? Ended up bringing an artist, um, Arthur Beattie was an African-American uh, artist that I met in Paris in 94, that I brought here, and we did a lot of shows Mostly for Jim Moran, who's a you know a, an entrepreneur who died, but you know he sponsored a lot of stuff I did.